As leaders grapple with money issues across the country, in Tana River, residents are happy to display a fairly unfamiliar side of their county. Indeed, Tana River has been known for little more than the frequent intertribal clashes. But it turns out that it is also a melting pot of various cultures from across the country. And as our senior coast reporter Ferdinand Mondi found out, it also revolves around fish. Mama Jane Opio chops away. She is making firewood for use in her daily business at the village of Moa in the Tana Delta. Once she's done, she collects the pieces and heads to the village smokehouse. Mama Jane Opio is a fishmonger who arrived here from Ugenya in Western Kenya way back in 1976 in search of fish. <laughs> Mama Opio is among a community of Luos who have swapped their native Nyanza homes and the shores of Lake Victoria for the banks of the Tana River. Here they found the pastoralist Orma people who they have nicknamed Jodhok, which loosely translates to livestock keepers. They also found the Tana River infested with crocodiles and hippos but also abounding fish and they made here home. Bernard Nyanga, who hails from Kano Plains, says he has been in the Tana Delta for 20 years and singles out Moa village as his best residence. Sehemu zingine nilikuwa na jaribu lakini nilikuwa nanalemewa na maisha. Lakini nilipofika hapa naona ninajimudu kabisa ki maisha. Naweza kulisa familia, naweza kupeleka mtoto shule. Ndio maana nikaamua ni settle hapa. But it is not just the Luos who stay here. The lucrative fish trade has also attracted the Luhia community who are traditionally farmers. Among them is Mama Margaret Juma who first arrived at the Delta in 1982 and settled at the Bura scheme to do what she knew best. She says she traded in fish around the delta between 1992 and 1999. That year she got caught up for the first time in the infamous intercommunity clashes pitting farmers and pastoralists during her stay in the Bililo area. In Moa, Margaret says she found the people living together well in spite of ethnic differences. The native Ormas have accommodated the Luhias, Luos and Giriamas who have made the river in village home. Hapa tunaisa urafiki tu. Wajaluo tunaka ujaluoni, waluya wanaka uluyani, wagiriyama wanaka ugiriyama, wakorma wanaka uhorma. Sauri luga, jetulewa, tuelewani. While Kiswahili breaks the language barrier, some of them have gone the extra mile to understand each other's languages. Margaret, for instance, speaks Luo rather well. The symbiosis has extended to the cultural practices. Uh, one such orma who has substituted livestock for fish is Filippo Barisa. We found Barisa just back from an outing in the river, and it appears he learned his trade quite well. Some of the catch was still live and kicking. The mudfish and its cousins are known to last long out of the water. With plenty of fish to go around and adequate arable and grazing land, the people of Moa are making a killing. <laughs> Alafu nikaja nikageuka mkulima nikaona kuna ardhi ya kustawisha. 
Moa village is a perfect example of how cohesion works. Not only do communities of different ethnic backgrounds live together harmoniously, they're also learning from one another in a mutually beneficial relationship. The successful sharing of resources here is a distant cry from what happens beyond the village where a scramble for similar resources has led to bloody killings between communities for decades. In 2012, at least 200 died in the Tana Delta over unresolved disputes pitting pastoralists and farmers which boiled over to tribalism and politics. Yet as the killings swept the Delta, Moa village survived and scarred. When you know, God, Indeed, Barissa, who hails from one of the warring communities, is grateful that where he lives, peace has prevailed, and as such, the village sticks together as a family in good times and bad times. And as long as the peace and understanding prevails, Moa village and its resources earns its people a living. The fish court is sold in wholesale to major traders as far as Mombasa, while local vendors buy their stock for sale in neighboring areas like Garsen and Tarasa. Kono <laughs> 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 <laughs>